Well, the announcement relates to funding of a very large grant which makes Mayo continue to be a part of a, of a network across the United States of grants supported by the National Institutes of Health to study pharmacogenomics, that is the role of inheritance of who your mom and dad were with regard to the way you respond to drugs. Uh, this network was established in the year 2000. Mayo has been one of the nodes of the network for, uh, since it began. And this is exciting news because it means that we're going to continue to do so, applying the most modern techniques of genomics to drug response, mainly drug response of patients who have breast cancer and what I was talking to the two young people outside about, uh, patients who uh, suffer from depression and are treated with the drugs we use to treat depression. So it is exciting. It means we're part, I will be spending Monday and Tuesday uh, with all of the other grant recipients at a retreat where we will be organizing the network for the next five years. So you said the, the grant money is going to be used to research breast cancer drugs and what was the... Uh, this, at, at Mayo, it, at Mayo. We, our major focus will be on drugs that are used to treat patients with breast cancer and depression. Did you make